there is no lighters, etc. So how are we going to provide light? So is it possible that with a manac and a solenoid and just a light bulb, will the light bulb uh, light up? So just give you a minute, think about it. Okay. So now you observe the motion. Very important, observe the manac motion relative to the solenoid. Okay. Okay. So do you all see the light? Relative motion between the solenoid and the manac, okay, the LED light bulb will light up. If there isn't any motion, just by putting there, there won't be any. Some misconception, okay, students will arise because textbook always illustrate this that the manac move, but what about the solenoid moving? So this is one of the misconception that we have to highlight because most of the book they illustrate using the manac approaching the solenoid. So we can have to convince the student that if we move the solenoid relative to the manac, it will also produce a diffraction in the galvanometer. So long as there is relative motion between these two there will be an ENF produced.